I think that institutions need to anticipate the regulatory framework, of which we know now really quite a great deal, but also, of course, factors like Brexit uh, and some of the other factors that are emerging as changing their environment very radically by what I know many are doing when I go around and talk to them now, which is that they're rethinking their strategic plans. Um, and I think that uh, those which do that well will actually find the opportunities um, because in, uh, for every challenge there's an opportunity. Those that don't do it well, I think, may struggle actually to find what their voice is within the sector and what their kind of central purpose is. And I think there's going to be some tough decisions actually. Some universities will have to decide what they can no longer afford to do um, and what they might want to do rather differently or to redistribute resource. The problem is, as we know with higher education, is higher education is a long run game and actually there are significant barriers to change in universities in terms of governance, the kind of the democracy in them, the way in which actually there is a kind of a culture that time itself is an important factor in new research ideas, all of which I very strongly believe in. But for some institutions I think that the timetable will have to be somehow shortened in order for them really to, as I say, to, to be distinctive in what is after all a crowded marketplace and which I think the government deliberately wants to introduce new competition in um, uh, uh, so, so that actually the factors that I'm talking about will, will become clearer and, and maybe there will be casualties. Whether there'll be real casualties, I don't know. I think there's going to be a lot more talk about collaboration and partnership and alliances actually in the future. Um, I, I'm not sure I'm a great believer in merger, but I'm, I'm sure that collaboration, partnership, alliance is going to be one of the factors that will come out of the way in which many universities will start thinking very seriously about how they cope with the, the future that they can foresee.